military activities in this area, this densely populated areas, would be of course an an, an unphenomenal uh, catastrophe uh, and an enormous uh, uh, would even further expand <clears throat> the humanitarian disaster beyond imaginations. They continue actually to obstruct delivery of humanitarian support since November. Only for WHO, 40% of our missions to the north, for example, have been facilitated. Only 40%. Since January, the figure is much lower. These missions have been denied, impeded, or postponed. Approximately 45% of the mission requests for the south are facilitated. It's not only about direct attacks on the hospitals. It's also about military activities close to the hospital. Uh, patients, uh, ambulances cannot access, patients cannot uh, access, health workers cannot ex- access, WHO and partners cannot bring supply, and very quickly the hospital, from being partially functional, it becomes non-functional, barely functional. Hospitals completely overwhelmed and overflowing and undersupplied. The health workers need actually a, they need a relief. Many are cut off of, of, of uh, from their families.